With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So students, we have a question that what is the minimum value of f needed so that block begins to move upwards? Okay on frictionless inclined plane okay so students in this let me explain you that this is a pulley okay and this is attached here with a fixed end here it is block a uh, block of mass m attached so we are applying a force with theta degree at theta degree okay so we have to find that what will be the minimum value what will be the f min for which this block will start moving upward okay so student we can see that this is this will be mg the weight of the block okay so this will be theta okay this will be theta so now this will be mg cos of theta and here it will be mg sin of theta this is a free body diagram and we are resolving the force component of weight okay so now we can see that in this case tension will be in this direction okay and for this let us suppose this f this will be f cos theta and this will be f sin of theta okay so now students we have drawn the free body diagrams and let us equate the equation so we can see that this mg sin of theta is equal to this t tension plus this f cos of theta how this f comes okay so we know that we have resolved it through this okay so now we can say that mg sin of theta and this tension is also the force how this is force because we are applying f min here in this direction this is repelled by the tension so we can say that from here tension is equal to force so here in place of tension we will write f only okay so now students if we take here f common so it will be mg sin of theta upon 1 plus cos of theta okay so now students in this we can see that if we if we use this formula and if we use trigonometric equations and resolve it we will get that f will be equal to 2 mg and here it will be sin theta by 2 cos theta by 2 how this came because sin 2 theta is equal to 2 cos theta let me write more clearly for you this is because sin 2 theta is equal to 2 cos theta sin theta so here theta will become theta by 2 okay so for lower part it will be 2 cos square theta by 2 into cos of theta by sorry it, it will be only theta cos theta by 2 so now we can see that this will be cancelled this 2 and 2 will be cancelled okay and this oh sorry we have done a mistake here it will be cos square theta only okay so this 2 and 2 will be cancelled this cos theta will cancel this square and the answer will be mg sin theta by cos theta will be tan theta by 2 so mg tan theta by 2 will be the minimum force which will be required so mg tan theta by 2 option 1 is the correct option for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level 
ट्रस्टेड बाई मोर देन फाइव करोड़ स्टूडेंट्स डाउनलोड डाउट एंड आप टूडे